you are always free to manage diabetes however you choose. Diabetes is a serious disease, but unlike other medical conditions, people living with this chronic incurable disease have complete freedom to choose whether to treat it as a dead serious matter or just an annoying inconvenience. It causes no physical pain. There are no dramatic symptoms. So through years of making small temporary dietary changes, getting routine medical checkups, adjusting your medications, and maintaining a stable A1C between 7 and 9%, everyone thinks and will even assure you that you are managing your diabetes very well. This is totally false, but you are always free to believe that it is true. In reality, no one will help you understand how to normalize crazy high diabetic levels of toxic glucose unless you actively demand and invest in competent professional support, which can be scarce and difficult to find. Typical medical care is continuous, costly, and brief. In 20 or 30 minutes, no professional spouse, friend, or neighbor can teach you what you must know to survive diabetes well. The common goal of most healthcare is for you to be able to resume your favorite foods and regular medications with minimal lifestyle changes and to take one or more anti-diabetic medications. The common result is that you rarely see any meaningful short or long-term improvements in your blood sugar levels. Insanity or craziness is defined as every day expecting or hoping for different, safer, more normal glucose levels while spending months and years following the same advice from the same healthcare professionals, taking the usual anti-diabetic drugs at smaller or larger doses, eating more or less the same diet that you've liked since childhood and relying on familiar diabetes self-care habits. It's crazy because it doesn't work to protect your body. That pointless, uneducated pursuit of a dream also defines today's standard treatment for persons with diabetes mellitus. Of course, every individual with type 2 or type 1 Diabetes must freely make the choice to follow this path to a frequently premature end of life. But can you be taught and learn to control diabetic glucose values or return them to safe non-diabetic levels? With competent diabetes education, of course. In 1948, one of the first diabetologists said, education of the person with diabetes is not part of the treatment. It is the treatment. And even if you can never control diabetes because it is incurable, you can learn to bring your glucose readings to safe, normal, or near normal levels. Every person with diabetes is always free to choose foods and use medications in educated ways that produce measurable and repeatable non-diabetic blood sugar levels. Learning this practical skill finally enables you to achieve good control of diabetes and its hyperglycemia. I am Dr. Stan DeLoach of Diabetes Done Right I have lived with type 1 diabetes for over 56 years. I invite you to visit me and my colleagues in Spain and the United States when you want to begin the journey towards safe, normal,
blood sugar levels. In this video, you learned that every person with diabetes has the freedom to decide and achieve their own glycemic goals. You have every right to normal blood glucose values. Normal glycemic values are the safest. And today, with our competent diabetes education, they are easily and rapidly achieved by anyone with diabetes mellitus.